Yes, I believe so. Holy, the deep right field. That goes Morris near the wall, and it's out of here. Uh, going in, having a, a good spring training 2.0 is very important for me. After months of negotiations. Now the one-two to Weeders. And he got him. Baseball is back. So to see something uh, get set in stone for the fans is is what, what makes this exciting. Josh Tolley with his second major league home run. And Southern Tier native Josh Tolley. And I live in Owego in a small town. Is headed to Yankee right Spring Training. From my understanding, it's going to be at Yankee Stadium, so it makes my drive a little bit easier. And that ball is gone. If Tolley isn't able to crack the Major League roster. Well, there'll be no minor league season at all. Josh Tolley ties the game with his second home run of the year. He'll look to be a part of the Yankees' expanded one. And there'll be a group of other players going to an alternate site to uh, stay in shape in the event something, uh, you know, a uh, player gets injured or, or what have you. For the first time in his career. And Tolley cracks one to deep right center. Tolley was able to spend part of the summer in Owego with his wife and three kids. I'm a full-time dad at this point. Um, the hard part with the coronavirus and no school, I was also their teacher. But he was still able to stay in shape for when Major League Baseball gave players the green light. There's a group of guys that we'd go down to Vesto High School and uh, we, we were playing some sim games and live BP. Swing and a miss. Tolley was an all-star with the Binghamton Mets in 2009. And they, they will never forget the 2009 year that I had in Binghamton. Johan Santana has thrown the first no-hitter in New York Mets history. And spent four seasons in Queens, becoming a part of Mets history. Probably Johan's no-hitter definitely uh, stands up there. And now he heads to the Bronx, looking to make those memories on the other side of the city. In Binghamton, Jacob Seuss, 12 News.